Hi guys, Brad with Monero Marine. For those who have been watching our videos, you may have noticed that I haven't posted anything in about a year. That's mostly because there's been a big change for our business. Uh, we've been working out of the same shop for since 1995 and we were faced with a doubling of our lease rate last year. So we either had to find something much more affordable or shut down. And my dad was at the age to retire and uh, so that was a good opportunity for him. So he did retire in the most part and we also did find another place to carry on our business. So here we are, new shop. Uh, uh, maybe I'll do a, a video uh, in the future showing our new, new place here. But on uh, this video, I want to show you steering for a 9.9 .9 Suzuki outboard. Uh, the customer, he wanted hydraulic steering and he wanted a steering wheel at the stern. So the first thing I needed to do was to find a cylinder. Uh, we use C Star. So we've used the side mount cylinder on the 9.9 .9 Yamahas, but never on the Suzuki. So the first thing I did was go to YouTube and look on there for something. Well, I couldn't find anything that, that uh, was useful. Uh, so the next thing I did was phoned up C-Star factory and asked them, you know, does this side mount cylinder work on the Suzuki 9.9? And they really couldn't tell me. Okay, fine. Uh, I did a little more research and I decided let's just get this cylinder and let's try it out. So let's show you the whole system. It was pretty simple and it worked well. First off, let's look at the helm. It's a Sea Star HH5271 3 hydraulic helm and is an 8 inch aluminum steering wheel. This is the place I chose to mount the helm and it just required a spacer just so your fingers don't get pinched uh, in the deck there. So it's just a 3 quarter inch piece of starboard which I cut on my CNC. Hoses we use the HO5100 series connected to the orb fittings on the helm and I only required six feet for this application. This is where I mounted the control for the kicker. I had to fill in the opening in the pocket there and we reupholstered so we can mount this uh, control and that worked fine and I just had to put a little notch in the the back panel there to run the harness and the cables uh, the cables we used are again C star uh, what is it CCX 633 series the cylinder I use is the HC5370-3. Now one thing you do have to watch out for is that this doesn't go out beyond the side of the boat, especially when you're docking. You need clearance on this side as well. So this is fixed, it doesn't move, it's just this side that comes in and out so the motor is center right now so it will it will come out more um, but you just have to watch for that uh, now installation is quite simple it just threads into the uh, tilt tube and you connect the link bar here and that comes with your Suzuki motor uh, including all the hardware, the fasteners. So it went on quite simply. Uh, and then you get to fill it up with the hydraulic fluid. 
use uh, only the Sea Star stuff, and it comes with the instructions to bleed it. And there you go. Simple as that. Thanks for watching.